Lessons. Today I am coming to you with a haul video. What? I went to Kmart very recently with Brendan. He was like, hey Cheyenne, you should totally go to Kmart and buy lots of stuff so then you can do a video about it. And I was like, hell yeah. I don't know what came over him that day, but hey, I was, I took it and I ran with it. I don't want to make this video too long, so I'm just gonna go straight into this, this bag of goodies that I've got here. Let's have a look what's inside. Quarantine! So the first thing I want to show you that's in this bag is this awesome, awesome stuff. It's like mist, fragrance mist, orchid scented. And there's all different types there, but this one was definitely the best smelling one. Oh, it's so good. It just makes you feel so fresh. As soon as I sprayed it in the store, I instantly fell in love with this flavor. It smells like you've just gotten fresh out of the shower, which is great for disgusting people like me because, you know, when I don't shower and I need to smell like I have just showered, this is my lifesaver. I'm kidding, guys. I shower like, you know, at least twice a week. I highly recommend you check this out. Go down to Kmart. There was heaps of them there. I'm not really sure what else to say about it except it's fucking delicious smelling. Mm. <sighs> While I was in the beauty aisle, I found this section that had a heavily, heavily discounted creams and things like that. So I thought I'd pick them up so I could do a review on them. So here they are. Some shea butter hand and nail treatment. Just looks like this. Again, one dollar, one dollar. It's even got, you can smell it even like through the plastic seal and oh, yum. I'm very excited to be putting this on because it smells delicious. Here's another one, a uh, body butter in strawberry and it literally smells like, it smells like a strawberry milkshake, which now I want a strawberry fucking milkshake. I'm um, not really sure what kind of brand it is. It's just probably Kmart brand or something. Uh, another thing I got was a foot treatment. Uh, this actually reminds me a lot of Mean Girls, so I had to try it. And also I've got disgusting feet, as you probably would have seen in my last video. And I love anything with the word mint in it. Peppermint, spearmint, entertainment. I also got this hair treatment, which is just keratin, which I desperately need because I dye my hair so much and I want to see how it works and compare it to other treatments that I've tried. So if you'd like me to review these, give this video a thumbs up and let me know in the comments because like they're, as I said, they're very cheap and if they work and they're cheap, it's a fucking bonus. So another thing that I got in the beauty aisle was a mirror. <laughs> I've been wanting one of these mirrors for a long time, but I also, I got it for Brendan because um, he always has trouble showering. No, he has trouble shaving in the shower. Obvious reasons, there's no fucking mirror in there. So I got him this to like hang, not really sure how it works or what, if it is even going to hang in there, but we'll we'll sort that out. You don't need to worry your pretty little heads about that. The last beauty related product that I got were just these green tea facial wipes. They're for makeup removal, and I don't usually get the green tea flavor, but I decided to do something a little bit different this time and see how they go. After we were in the beauty aisle, we scooched on over to the women's clothing excuse me, the women's clothing aisle. And that is always probably the worst idea ever when you're around me. At the moment it's okay because I literally cannot fit in anything in the whole store unless it's maternity or size 20 plus. There's a child invading my body and it's making things very hard to wear. But I luckily stumbled across this. I've worn it a lot, it's fucking dirty. But I had to show you. Is it, what? It's a dress, but because of my gut, it only works as a shirt for me, which is good because I need long shirts so that it, my gut doesn't hang out. It's exactly the same as this. It's a t-shirt dress and it was $10. And because I love this one so much, I got this one a few weeks ago. I got this one. It's really cool. It's got like folded sleeves. You know how people like 
fold their sleeves and they never stay up. Yeah, well this is sewed in place and it clearly works. So <laughs> it looks like this on. Um, I've got no pants on so I'm not going to show you. <laughs> Another thing that I got was this singlet. I find that um, having this big pregnancy gut makes like clothes not fit properly quite obviously. So I need something like longer to cover my butt crack. <laughs> and that's where this comes in. I've got a few black ones already that I wear underneath everything so I thought I'd get something that was a bit not black even though it's got black on it. So it's like a greeny fucking foul green color but I love it. So it was eight dollars and I think it's supposed to be like a little dress or something. What's it say here? Oh it's a long cam. Okay. So it's supposed to be long, which is great for pregnant bellies and probably just so that if you're one of those people that like bends over and your ass crack hangs out, which is a lot of people, these things are great for covering that. And also covering cleavage if you don't want to show off your titties to everyone. After that we popped on over to the book section and I had heard and seen a lot about all these like adult colouring in books for mental health and just for fun really and I've been like pretty intrigued to get one. I've seen them all over Instagram, all over Facebook. So I found some in Kmart but they were all fucking shit and half of them were like already coloured in for you and they were boring and they were like ooh flowers and pattern. I don't know. I didn't like any of the designs. I think they were like $12 was the cheapest one. So I was like, uh, nah mate, I'm gonna go to the kids section and I got this <laughs> for a dollar um, or two dollars I think it was actually and like it's got so much better things to colour in. I'm not sure if you guys know but I love Marvel, anything with Marvel on it but yeah. And it's also got a Wolverine mask on the back, so you can't go wrong with that. To go with that, I bought some, what are these, Crayola coloured pencils, and they all look pretty good. I love Crayola. Crayola, they're a great brand. But these are quite cheap. I'm not sure how much they were, maybe like $4 or something, maybe less. I don't know. I always remember Crayola being like super expensive, so I was never allowed to have it growing up, so... Haha, <laughs> I get to have them now because I'm an adult. Yes, I've got some sharpeners. They were like a dollar. Oh no, that was 75 cents for two. So, bargain. And the other thing I got was a pencil case to keep it all in and I get to, you know, cut out my name and put it there. I used to love them when I was younger too. Everyone did. Come on, I used to always put rude words in there. Probably still going to do that. Let's be honest. <laughs> the very last thing that I got were these shoes. They're just slip on shoes for me to wear with pretty much everything because thongs are just too cold and I can't really bend over to do shoelaces up or to put like shoes on and stuff. And with these, I can just kind of slip these on and away I go. If I don't wear socks though, these little bits here kind of rub on my feet and it's quite painful. But it only does it when I don't wear socks, which I should be wearing socks anyway. They're just basic canvas material shoes and they were like $5, so I couldn't go past them. And black, because black goes with everything. Well, there you go. I think I survived that haul. I'm pretty happy with myself. What do you guys think? Please let me know how I did in the comments section below. If you would like to add me on any of my social media, networking sites then all of those links will be downstairs in my tits they're also up on the screen from time to time i want to try and get this video to maybe 43 likes so let's try and do that that's all for me today guys thank you all so much for watching and taking the time out of your day to watch me ramble about things that i bought for cheap i really appreciate it and i love you all so much skin on this. There's still hairs there. Why do I have to be such a sus one? What is wrong with these things? <laughs>